that day, hurricane was coming and we had the finder reach out to us because these dogs walked through her property, super scared. Whoever is close is the one that will go immediately to help. So I was the closest one. When I saw her, I was just like devastated. Dios mío, oh my God. I'm like, she looks 10 times worse in person than what you actually see on the video. I was like, okay, now I can breathe. She's gonna be fine. So I took what I had here in my house. It was a bed, it was food, a blanket, and kept her that night. It's okay. Okay? Okay? Finally, we took her to the vet, and pretty much everything came back cleared other than her bad nutrition and the severe infection. Thank you. You're so pretty. Thank you. It was just pretty much just giving her constant showers and big bath that would help her skin. I was the one that first bathed her. I was like, oh my God, I don't want to hurt this dog. But she was still so sweet, didn't bark once. From the day that we rescued her to the next Wednesday, her skin already changed dramatically. She was so willing to accept help and give us love right back. I just bought like, I don't know, like 10 toys. She grabbed that toy for the first time and you saw her like, you know, so happy. You're such a good girl. It sounds corny, but love changes everything. And I believe that that also has helped her heal faster. It's only been a month and a half. And it's crazy how much she has changed. She loves the foster brother too. They go for walks together. Sandy's amazing and she's helped kind of break that stereotype online. People just assume she's a big dog, she's a pit bull, she's going to be aggressive. And that couldn't be further from the truth. She is the sweetest dog ever. Good girl, sit, sit, sit. Good girl. Sandy is not yet ready for adoption. She will be soon, as soon as everything is 100% healed, then she will be ready to find her perfect forever family.